Yep. Should be interesting. Ooh, 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 nice little ones. Here comes the chuck chucks. No, no, get off! Get it! That's ass potato, get out! Look at him, get out! A scatty little monkey, get out! Mm. How many do we want? We only want one. Well, two, oh, get a, yeah, get a few. Just going down the woods. James just digging a few spuddies. Ooh, ooh, look at that. What a nice little collection. Look at that one. Look at that chicken. It's slightly green, just took that bit off. Well, too many for tonight, really, isn't it? No, it does good. Well, no, I've got the fork through that one. Put them down there and give them a... Mm. Oh, gosh. Ones just I like little ones, anyway. A couple just dropped down there, one day. Get another dig. That's a stinger. Oh yeah, that was as well. <laughs> oh blimey, what a yield. That's good, isn't it? Is that a worm? Yes. That's what they're after. Yeah. That's only the one. That's quite good. Yeah. Could have left it a while if it got a bit bigger, but I like them small, don't you? Yeah. I've got red ones. Which I think could have been two plants. It could have been, yeah. Anyway, there you go. So that's uh, that's going to be dinner. That's a fair yield of spuds on one dig. Right. Oh, oh, oh my! On, some more. God, <laughs> blimey! There's that's loads quite in low. there. Yeah. Better get them. Must be a couple of plants there, I think. Yeah. Didn't think so. Anyway, so we'll carry on digging these, and then we'll catch a bit later. Oh, that was an impressive yield, isn't it? Look at that. Bit of a green one, we'll get, we'll get rid of that. Okay. Okay, in the van. This is going to be a traditional Danish disc called Stick Flick. Stick, I don't know. Who knows what it is? I don't know what it is. It's a Danish dish which consists of belly pork, which is cut finely, um, and green beans. No, potatoes, not green beans. Potatoes, new potatoes, and parsley sauce. It's a traditional dish, but we're going to add a bit of variety because we've got some organic potatoes. So I'm not going to chuck it in. How many do you reckon? Just got these beautiful out in the garden. Um, that should be enough. Put a few more in. That'll do, won't it? Will it? Um, that'll do. Well, there you go. Organic. All right. Fill a little water. Top them up. Okay, let's get this going. But we've got green beans as well to go on. So I need for my next door neighbour. I didn't steal them. He gave me. Look how green they are. Beautiful. Organic. Yummy. This cooker's from at the. Uh, Garage. Still look at that, works well. Okay, so let's get them on. Then once they get them to the boil, we'll put the green beans on and then we're gonna break out Old Faithful, which is La Skillet. Now, yeah, traditional dish from Denmark. Um, friend of mine, well, friend of Jane's came over, not a friend of mine, she's a friend of mine as well. She came over. And said it was really nice actually, it's a nice dish. I'll show you it. So get the skillet ready, it might break out another. But it's very how can I say it? It's a very fatty dish, so you have to pour off a couple of runs of fat, but it'll season me bowl, season me pan anyway, so yep, so there's that. So new potatoes, green beans, parsley sauce. So we need another pan out, so we have to get the other cooker. Oh, blimey, it's all cooking today, isn't it? That'll have to be for the parsley sauce, I think. Alright. So I'll get that going in a bit. Right, okay. 
This is what it looks like. Okay, it's quite fatty. But once you've cooked it, it actually takes the fat off and it tastes absolutely beautiful. So I'll have four of these a piece. I bet you're thinking, oh, this cholesterol's going to go through the roof. I'm going to cause a controversy now. There's no such thing as cholesterol. There's good and bad, and you need both to, 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 to live. There we go. So that's that. We've got that ready as well. And get these cookers off eBay. They're brilliant. And from anywhere else, they can go outdoors. That's not a, nothing to do with them or anything. This thing's got the knob missing off it. You've got a little plastic knob on there. They're about a tenner, I think. 15 quid tops. And the canisters are just standard gas canisters. What's that one? Go system. Uh, this is a mixture of butane and, and propane, which I think I've said in other videos. It's quite a good um, thing to have because they'll keep working when it gets colder, which it is at the moment because we're in September now. Coming on the middle of September. So, and there we go. What would that take? Two minutes? So let them boil for about five and then I'll put the beans on top and then I'll start getting the the stick flesh, stick fleck ready. Remember that bloke off, um, what was he on? The Muppets. Put the pan in the pan and then they put the pan and put the bacon in the pan. That's what it seems like, that's what Danish, they talk like that. That was an insult, sorry. They don't really. A little bit of salt. A couple of little chassis. This off, you know, get these from. In your plastic McDonald's or something like that, or Burger King. Put a few in your pocket. <laughs> it's very convenient, actually. And then just add a little bit of salt. Before you put the beans in. Three of those little babies. There we go. Handy little sachets, as they call them. Right, let that keep boiling. Yeah, so stick flisk. James just flisk, stick flisk. All the beans. All right, so let go on. Two drop out. Oh, that'll be fine. Homemade utensil, another one. Okay, put the lid on that. Get that boil away. It's getting dark quick, isn't it? Winter's on our way. Right, so let's get that ready in a second. Got a bunch of these cans in the van. If you looked at putting it in use. <laughs> so it's breaking out another one, doesn't it? So just screw him on. There we go. Put him on the wooden board because he'll burn the carpet. Okay. Is it Tuesday evening? It is now 7 7 31. It's getting dark. Put extra light on. And cooking our evening meal in the woods with the deer.
weight's all right. Should be all right. No expense spared, you know, on lanterns. Look at this. Can you see that? Where is he? Oh, blimey, where is he? There he is, look. No expense spared. 12 quid. Well, <laughs> Sorry. Oh, I'll get there in a minute. There we go. We're going to splash a bit, but hey, it's alright. Look at the fat coming off already. We swap some of these around so I'll put that one on the outside now and this one on the inside. We all get an even cook. And I'll pour some of the fat off. Check out the other one. Very good. Check in. Oh, right. Check the big spuds, make sure they're done. A bit more. Not, not far off. You guarantee the little ones are done then. Okay. That's on. uh, the gas might be getting a bit low, but that's fine because I'm not bothered about that. And then I'll pour off some of this bacon fat in a minute. As you can see. Oh, so nice. There we go. This is quite a bit on there. Burnt, but less cooked. Put them on the inside now. And the more cooked ones are on the outside. You don't want to do until they're burnt, you just want to do until they're crispy. That's the same. Might take a bit more fat off in a bit, but at the moment, not bad at all. Sorry, it's quiet. There we go. Okay. Come off again. See the fat that comes off? Not 
far off now. Now it's time to party sort of. They've all shrunk down beautifully. Oh, I'll turn that one over. Look at that. Come on. Beautiful. I'm going to smell it. It smells gorgeous. Right. For a second longer, take them off the heat, put the parsley sauce on. Mmm. I think they're done there as well. So the greens should be done. The potatoes. Yes, perfect. Actually, they can come off the heat now, actually. Come on the mat. Not bad, not bad is it for van cooking. Come on, you can't go wrong with this. In the middle of a wood. Sorry if I'm in the way. Well, no, I should help. What's in there? Titanium spoon, by the way. Bug. Got him. Spare salt there, take the rest away. Oh, I'm going to turn that off now. Probably be lumpy. Not that bad, was it? A few little lumps, I'll squeeze them out. Look at that, how it smells. Great. That's it, ready for serving. Let's see what it looks like in a second. Just give that a stir, turn that off. Go on side. Burnt, semi burnt, middle burnt. That's it. I'll switch to the other one. That's all right. That's all right. Bit overcooked probably on my behalf, but it's my fault. Right now I'll drain the uh, veg. Back in a sec. Sorry. Alright. Jane loves little ones. Those green beans as well. So. Mm. 
It's not that bad washing up either. Look how clean that is. Just swill it when we get back done. Lumpy bits. Um, so I might just put a bit more milk in that. Be too much, but a hey, pasta sauce can't go wrong. That cooled down a little bit. You see that? Sorry, am I in your way? Probably, and then there we go. I gotta admit, this is um, great, but I found it. I know it's in the garage. We had it. Sorry, you can't even see where I'm doing that. That cooker, see, it's nice little camping cookers. With the propane and butane, they're right in the winter, so you need the mixed gas, otherwise they don't work very well. Well, they will in the summer, but not in the winter, because it's getting colder. So I'm moving across here a bit. Oh, it's sticking out lovely. Look at that. You can't tell me you can't do this in the woods. Come on guys, you've got to get out there. And girls, there we go. I'll give you a taste. Well, I don't need a taste. And that's it. A traditional Danish dish, but without the green beans. It's, no, yes, without the green beans. So it's potatoes, parsley sauce, and this. Where has she said it was anyway? Flesh, anyway, whatever. Flesh, flesh. I don't know. Right. Hope you enjoyed. Take care. I'll try again. Now the next video I'm going to do, hopefully, is going to be uh, to do with the van, and I want to put a sunroof. Not a sunroof, I want to put a um, solar panel on the roof and do a full solar panel in, um, video for you. So, there we that. But look at that, come on. Beautiful. And the owls have just started to hoot. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the vid just put a like which helps a great deal because we don't get paid for the videos just for the ads i can do more videos take care see you in the next one all the best just to prove this is where we are oh it's getting dark now and that's the light of the van Just to show we've done some cooking and we're in the woods. Because <laughs> anybody thinks I'm in the back garden. Right, thanks once again. Cheers and all the best.